have a crush. When someone has a crush on someone else, it means that they are attracted to, obsessed with, romantically interested in that person. You have a crush on our teacher, one of your university classmates might giggle after you mention how handsome you think the teacher is. Maybe you're gossiping with a friend. You've had a crush on her since high school? You definitely need to ask her out. I've had a crush on our manager since I first met her at the company Christmas party. One of your co-workers might be telling you a secret. As is plain to see, having a crush on someone means that you are enchanted, captivated, spellbound, seduced by, interested in them. Having a crush on someone is most often used amongst younger folk and often implies a temporariness to the infatuation, fondness, preoccupation. According to Cole Opterist's research shared via Stack Exchange, the idiom have a crush finds its origins in the word mash circa the late 1800s. Mash comes from the Romani word masherava, meaning infatuation, allure, entice. But as verbs in English, mash and crush share the meaning of reducing something to a uniform consistency. As happens often in language, these two words with similar meanings came to be used interchangeably, and by the end of the 19th century, the word crush came to replace mash entirely. I think someone has a crush on me, your friend might excitedly tell you after she finds a note and small gift slipped into her bag. Perhaps you're chatting with a friend. I seem to get a crush on every cute girl I meet. I wish this wouldn't happen. It's natural to have a crush on an attractive colleague. Just don't do anything about it. You might be telling your married friend. So, the next time you find that you are attracted to, infatuated with, electrified by, can't stop thinking about someone, no, that you have a crush on them.